In this video I'll show you why you should dump Red Bull into your toilet and what exactly happens then. Later in the video I'll also show you an alternative that I'm sure you'll like better and that you should definitely try. So be sure to watch the video until the end. But why should we dump Red Bull into our toilet? Red Bull contains citric acid and citric acid has a wonderful cleaning power even in the toilet. For that you need to spread Red Bull into your toilet so that there is some of the Red Bull everywhere. Then we need one more ingredient and that is baking soda. Now I use the baking soda from my own store. You'll find the link to the store at the bottom of the video description. So be sure to check out the store. From the soda we now take about 2 tablespoons still with it and also we also distribute this now everywhere in the toilet. The reason for this is that soda and citric acid have a really wonderful cleaning power together. But right away I want to show you what really works even better here and what you certainly like a little better. Here you now have to wipe everything only once with the toilet brush, rinse and everything is clean again. But if you don't have Red Bull, which has expired, you can of course also take citric acid in powder form. We also have this in the store, you can also find it linked below in the video description. This is of course much better because you do not have to waste the Red Bull here. If this has expired anyway, you can of course continue to use it wonderfully for the toilet and do not have to tip it so easily down the drain. Otherwise you can take this citric acid which is of course also more concentrated and therefore has a much better cleaning performance. To do the whole thing now you should simply distribute about 3 tablespoons of citric acid in the toilet and then add baking soda. Here you can see directly that everything starts to form really strongly because it reacts with each other. And so urine deposits, lime and also all kinds of other dirt can be removed from the toilet. Then let it soak in for about 30 minutes. After that start scrubbing everything and the toilet will be really clean again. You should only flush once or twice. And so citric acid and baking soda is really a great combination to clean the toilet without having to use really big chemicals here or any other cleaners. At this point I'm going to link you another video where I show you how you can clean your toilet with a dishwashing tab. Be sure to check out that video as well. If you liked the video then I would be really happy about a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and activate the bell so you don't miss any new video.